The Myelin Repair Foundation's mission is to accelerate the pace of progress in treatments for multiple sclerosis. MRF came to the Boston Consulting Group for help in optimizing their innovation and collaboration networks. Let's take inflammation suppression as an example. This diagram represents the interrelationships of all researchers who have published three or more articles on inflammation in the past two years. Inflammation is thought to play a key role in MS, but as this diagram illustrates, it is a huge and complex field in which even the best researchers are likely to be aware of only a subset of the universe of research. Jointly with MRF, we chose to zoom in on the researchers noted here, in green, who are focused on a short list of specific protein targets and whose work involved neurodegenerative disease. By examining the collaboration, topic, and patent citation networks in this subset, we were able to show whether and where researchers were connected to MRF's fields of investigation. Here we see a key MRF researcher and the various patents, researchers, and companies to which he and his work are connected. But it was actually those on the periphery, not previously involved in myelination or myelin repair that proved to be the most valuable. Within a few days, we had a short list of new ideas as well as specific researchers and companies for MRF to pursue. In some cases, MRF thinks this approach may have shaved years off their research agenda. Another aspect of the Myelin Repair Foundation's mission is to foster productive collaboration among key MS researchers. The Boston Consulting Group's network visualization tools enabled MRF to monitor their progress against this goal and for the first time to be able to demonstrate it to funders and other stakeholders. Here we see how the co-publication networks of Brian Popko and Stephen Miller, two important MRF-affiliated researchers, looked in 2003 when Popko was at New York University. This time series view, starting in 2004 when Popko moved to the University of Chicago, and when both researchers became affiliated with MRF, shows the evolution, expansion, and increasing interconnection of their networks to the present day. MRF sees this as evidence that their collaboration and funding strategies are on track to significantly advance the science of MS treatment.